Hi, I'm David John with General Produce Company here in Sacramento, California. Just a few miles away from us, we have one of the great apple gardens of the world, and that's Apple Hill. And you can see they put out a tremendous amount of varieties. One of the great thing about it is you can still find Macintosh, you can still find some Jonathan's, things that you're not seeing commercially grown anymore because they've saved the trees and they're able to put up small volumes because there's not a lot of demand for roams anymore. It's kind of a soft apple and people are into a little harder one. But we have a couple traditional ones here. They're Fuji's and they're Gala's that they put out. They're very popular on their golds. You don't want to miss that. The one thing that you'll notice is the apples are a lot more natural color. You don't find that great shine that you'll see to the north because they're not polished out. They're just naturally cleaned and packed along that line. The other thing too you'll see at times is the size varies a little bit. But you know, they're all edible, they're all very good. And along with their juice, that's almost year round now, you can find the apples now and you don't want to miss it. Now one of the apples that's really coming up and you're seeing more and more of it, and it's been out for the last few years, is an apple called Honeycrisp. And it's actually a cross and you're seeing this come out of the north and the popularity is building and building. And along with that, growers are converting more and more of the orchards over to it. So price-wise now can tendency to be a little bit high. It's worth the money, but shortly down the road, you're gonna find it competitive with Fuji's and Gala's just because of the volume that'll be coming up. But this great colored apple, you'll see these early ones have a little more green, but they'll get almost full colored red as they go are rock hard crisp, sweet as can be. They're even sweeter than a Fuji in most people's opinion. And this is something that is real treat that you wanna try. This has been a cross between a common apple in New York that's called a Macoon and then also a honey gold that is here. Now the honey gold is actually a new apple that was only created in the 70s and it was a golden delicious that was crispy from the earlier golds that was always soft. So they've taken that one more level added even more sugar to it, more crispness, and come up with this jewel you don't want to miss. So the apple of the future, and that's the produce beat.